Hey everybody, and welcome back to my Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge playthrough. In the last episode, I told you that I was going to level up my Pokemon a little bit, but then I decided not to because it is too much of a tedious process to worry about right now. Um, but I did manage to level up Aurora and Silver to 43, and I played around with Rhonda a little bit to maybe, you know, like level her up some also, but I don't know. I'm kind of thinking I'm, I want to take on the gym now, even though, you know, my Pokemon are probably under-leveled. Um, but the whole thing about a randomizer Nuzlocke is I could be up against a Kakuna, and I would be okay, you know, if that's, you know, if that's the case or whatever. <clears throat> and I have a lot of Hyper Potions, too. But of course, in game, I'm you know I'd be afraid to switch too much. But I also have a lot of Pokemon in reserve if I do happen to be wiped out. So I shouldn't I shouldn't worry so much. But I do, I do. I'm terrified of these gyms and losing Pokemon. And I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I healed up. But let me just make doubly sure that everybody's all healed up and ready to go. Because I like I said, I did do a little bit of training beforehand um but i'm just this is probably a very bad idea on my part you know to just go in go in here and be like hey i'm ready to go let's battle but you know that's me that's what's gotten me in trouble so far in this crazy playthrough Trying to remember exactly what I did. Oh, I remember. I remember what I did. This is a very interesting concept for a gym. Um, so who do I want to lead with? I don't want to lead with Rhonda because I like her too much. And that's what makes this so stupid. Like, why am I rushing into this? I'm going to lead with Miyaki because. Actually. Let me lead. Yeah, let me lead with Miyagi. Oh my god, here we go. I'm doing it. I talked to him. Did you know? It was I who taught Wallace everything there is to know about Pokemon. I don't like this guy. He looks dapper, but he's kind of douchey. Okay. Okay, we're gonna try. Oh, he has five Pokemon. Mankey, okay. Oh, level 41, that's like mine. I mean, I, well, 42, but still. Okay, keep, just keep doing that. Oh, good. Okay, he's down to four. Swalot. Hmm. Mm hmm. I want a Pokemon that he cannot poison. So I'm going into Silver. Level 41. Okay. So far, they've all been kind of the same. Um. Ooh. Oh, good. Oh. Dugong. Um. I go back into Miyagi. I reckon. No. Mm. Yes. I'll, I'll go into Miyagi. Level 43. Oh no. Okay, that missed. Okay. We're in. We're in some kind of business. Ledian. I keep just announcing the Pokemon that he's going to use, even though he can read it. I'm just into that. Come on, Rhonda. You can do this. And like I said before, I'm pretty sure I mentioned it in another video. I would love to see Lady and get a Mega Evolution. How just amazing would that be? Safeguard. That did not help you. Manetric! I might be okay. Oh no! 
Mm. I'm going to hype potion. Because I need to. Bite is all it can do. Oh my god. Foe's party is no longer. Oh. I don't care. Hype potion again. Okay. Hit five times. You know what? I could be a douchey. Okay, that didn't work. Hype potion. <laughs> Hit five times. Oh, come on. He's gonna use his potion. So I'm gonna use mine. Wait, I know he has one. Why didn't he use any of his potions? You know, that was almost a flawless victory. I merely jest. <laughs> Aren't you hilarious? Well, God, why was I so <laughs> about this guy? You know what? I might combine this into the other video. Because I thought this was just going to be a big deal, and I was just going to have the hardest time. And. I was going to lose some Pokemon, and I was going to be upset about it, but that was not the case. And I registered him, yay. Okay, so... Um... That was Juan. That was very underwhelming, actually, for the final gym. Nuzlocke challenge. Well, at least... At least it wasn't like... I don't know, Kyogre. Or something crazy. But still, I fully expected someone to die. I didn't even know I didn't even need to level up my Pokemon, really. So I guess Well, I need to teach Pokemon Waterfall. Mmm. Let's see. I don't want I don't want Suicune to be the only... Like, I don't want her to be... Or it. To be the slave here. I might have to pull out Lori for this. For Waterfall. Let's do this. Let's, uh... Let's all actually give Lori... Waterfall and Surf. And then... If I want to, I could actually... I could actually switch out... Suicune, or Aurora for Lori, and then have Lori battle the Elite Four. That would actually be kind of cool. <clears throat> Just to have someone different. Wait, where are... what am I doing? Oh yeah, I'm teaching Waterfall and Surf. To someone else. Oh, I forgot Rhonda could learn Surf too. Would that be useful? However, Rhonda already knows for You know what? I am. I'm gonna teach her Surf. Because she is a princess and does not need Scary Face. And Lori will get Waterfall. Uh, water gun. Let's get rid of that. I'll probably teach her surf too, though. Um, but what? Where am I gonna go, though? That's the thing. That's the big question. Where is Indigo Plateau and stuff? Oh, I guess I need to go to Evergrande. Is that where it is? So I will surf there in this episode so that we have a place to go. Ah, oh, crap, I need to dive. Ugh. Dang it. 
Okay, well, I'll bring Aurora out again to dive. I hope I don't need dive again. Because it's just kind of like, I don't know, it's, it's a waste of an HM slot, in my opinion. It's kind of annoying to have, or to have to use. Um, I'm also going to buy some max repels. Oops. So that way... Max Repel. Mm. I'll get 10 more. 20 more? 20 more. 20 more. Because, I don't know. I just like having Repels. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of people... Symp or empathize with that. Um, where are they? Max repel. Good. But yeah, that was such a wonky little battle. I don't know. I'm grateful for it, but at the same time, I expected more than just one of my Pokemon to be hit, you know, by a move. <laughs> Because all the other, all of the other Pokemon that Juan had were just fainted, like pfft, nobody, nobody's business. Um, let me get rid of this Mystic Water. Yes. Because I might actually uh, do what I said and use Lori instead of Aurora, just to keep things interesting and change some Pokemon around. That was another Pokemon that I wanted to use anyway. Um, can I get... Can I go? Can I go this way, actually? I'm sure I can, yeah. This isn't Evergrande, though. Am I gonna have to dive under here or something? <laughs> I don't want to have to do that. I might just have to teach Lori dive. And I know I didn't use a repel. Oh! Is somebody I haven't fought yet? Nice. I ought to give Lori uh, the experience share. Let me do that. Oh gee, thank you. Okay, let's give her the experience share. No, oh, God, Dad, shut up. Give to Lori. There we go. Okay, I cannot go that way. God, how do I get to this place? Please don't tell me I have to dive. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Let me, uh... If I have to dive, I'll just teach her dive. Because it seems like that's something I may have to do. Did I battle you? Yes. Did I battle you? Zangoose. I have bad memories of Zangoose because he killed Pichu. Nice. Thanks, Caitlyn. Double battle, go! Harrison? <gasps> I actually know a swimmer named Harrison. Um, and this was stupid. I should have switched. Yep, that's not gonna help you. I'm sorry. Bye! But yeah, that's so funny. I actually know somebody who is on the swim team named Harrison, and he is a pretty cool guy. 
I don't know what he's doing now, though. He's one of those people that I kind of lost touch with. Oops. I'm an Evergrande, and I can catch a Pokemon here. Mm. I have Ultra Balls. So, whatever. Um... Okay. Oh, right, I had repels going on. <gasps> Pokemon Center, uh, yes. Oh, thank goodness. This place is so pretty! <gasps> Victory Road! Oh my god. Let me get a Pokemon here. And then, maybe in the next episode, we'll go on to Victory Road. Oh, what's here? Oh, <gasps> Tyranitar again! Oh! Don't be knocked out. Oh, it's a girl! Ew. She's not a princess like Rhonda. <laughs> oh, that works. Sandstorm's already happening, buddy. You don't have to. Oh, that's, that was crazy. Mmm. I'm going to try to catch it. <sighs> okay, I need... I need a sleeper Pokemon. Or a paralysis Pokemon. Pokemon! What does she know again? This is probably a really dumb idea, too, but... You know, it might have to be done, because spaghetti just doesn't do it. Doesn't put things to sleep when it should. So, hopefully, Silver can do it. Good job, Silver. You know, you know what's up. You know what has to be done. Because your life definitely depends on it, because you're a bug type. Oh, <laughs> bless your heart. So I got the Tyranitar that Spaghetti was not able to get for me. Give a nickname to the Captured Tyranitar. Yes. Let's name her... Well, going with the Game of Thrones trend. Because she... Ain't pretty either. She is really mean and awful and bleh, I don't like her. So, I guess with that said, hmm, God, that is, that are, I have so many Pokemon in waiting right now. This is fantastic. I know I have so many dead too, but This seems like it might be working out for me. Hopefully, I can get through Victory Road in one piece. And also, Battle the Elite Four in the coming videos. There's gonna happen really soon, and it worries me. Ugh, it's, I'm already nervous about it, but, um... Why do I keep going in there? I want to go up here and stand in front of Victory Road, because it, it's very symbolic. But anyway... I hope you guys have been enjoying this playthrough thus far, even though the last gym was kind of a bust. Um, it still worked out. I didn't kill anybody, and that works. So, in the next episode, I guess we're going to start taking on Victory Road. Right? Yeah. Okay, well. This should be very interesting. Um, and I can't wait to see what happens in the coming few episodes, hopefully. We could do this and battle the Elite Four and actually win this Nuzlocke so that we don't black out and just have to kill everybody off and it'll just be so sad. So thanks for hanging in there with me guys through thick and thin. You've been awesome and I will catch y'all next time.